Hey, what's up? Today we're going to be doing a little series I like to call You're Bad at Tinder. We haven't been doing this one as much. But uh, anyway, let's just get into it. This is You're Bad at Tinder number 95. Let's do it. Hey, what's up? Amanda, 24. I'm in love with someone, but I'm not sure. So I'm just gonna cheat on him until I figure it out. Swipe right if you wanna ruin our relationship. What, what, this is, Tinder is not the place to find out if you're in love with your person or not. So I'm just gonna, you know, go on Tinder, go on a bunch of dates, maybe sleep around a little bit, and then if I feel like he's better than all those people, then I'll, I'll know I love him. I think if you're not sure if you're in love, then you're probably not in love. If you're not sure you're in love and you're still on Tinder, then you're probably not in love. Her bio was, I'm good at holding things. Anika, 25, who photoshopped herself holding various different objects. Like a battle axe, a cucumber. Ooh, some sort of Starbucks drink. Ooh, bread. Oh, no, sorry, that's toast. Ooh, I don't know what that is. Some sort of orange liquid. Ooh, she's holding herself. Okay. Now it's just getting creepy. You've run out of things to hold. I like the sense of humor. I feel like if I was on Tinder, I would be looking for a sense of humor before anything else. Well, also a female. Although if I was single, if me and my wife broke up or whatever, I don't know, maybe I'd start experimenting. I don't know. I really hope she never breaks up with me. I hope we, I really hope so. I don't wanna get back into the dating pool. I don't wanna date again. I don't wanna do it. Just so you know, me and my wife are fine. She's not thinking about dumping me or anything. I know some of you got too real. I know you're part of this family. You're like our children. No, we're fine. Don't worry. Hi, bro. That outfit in the first pic is kind of cute, though. Oh, shit. Thanks, bro. Not gonna lie. You're kind of cute, too, bro. But, like, not in a gay way or something. Just like in a wanna kiss your lips kind of way, but not, like, gay or anything. Bro kiss. Totally, totally. I get it. Damn, they're really broing down right now. Hey, there's nothing wrong with a bro kiss, okay? A kiss between bros? There's nothing wrong with that. That's what my friends always tell me when they kiss me on the lips. They're like, don't worry, man. This is normal. All friends do it. Don't tell our wives. This seems like two friends found each other on Tinder. Kate, 29. Oh, come on, Kate. Look at those wrinkles. You're older than 29. This little old lady thinks she can trick Tinder. This little old lady's trying to catfish everyone on Tinder by making them think she's 29. That filter's not gonna work, old lady. You've got nice blue eyes, but that's it. That is the grumpiest looking dog, cat. I don't know if that, <laughs> I think it's a dog. It's the ugliest, grumpiest looking dog I've ever seen in my life. He's probably pissed because you shaved all his hair off. Blank, 19. I have a daughter named blank. Don't come around if you're gonna leave. Ain't got time for that. Don't date blacks. Oh my God. All my time goes into my daughter. PayPal is blank. Feel free to send money. It's needed 20 or higher. I'm in a complicated relationship straight. Five, six, 101 pounds. Uh, okay. I'll take your word on that. Average body, blonde hair, and blue eye, blah, 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 blah. I'm not reading the rest. You came right out of the gate just like, hey, if you're not going to raise my children, then don't come by. And then you prove that you're a racist. So first you're like, hey, you got to raise my children and I'm racist. Let me like, yeah, let me just sum this down. I'm going to do the bullet points for this profile. Basically, she said, if you're not going to raise my daughter with me, then don't come around. She's racist. She wants free money. And uh, she's very greedy because it has to be $20 or higher. She won't take those $5 donations. Come on now. She doesn't need that much money. She needs 20 or higher. <laughs> Again, this is probably one of the people on Tinder that's like, why don't I ever get any matches? I just don't get it. I presented myself the best way possible. No, you made yourself look like a crazy lady, a crazy racist lady who's basically just on Tinder to take money from men. That's how you portrayed yourself. And I'm pretty sure you lied about your weight, okay? 101 pounds, come on now. I'm not trying to be like, oh, she's definitely, but like 101 pounds, that's like a skinny little crackhead. 
Like, that's, that is too skinny. Maybe I'm just jealous, I don't know. I just want to be a skinny little crackhead. Allie, 26, living life with a brain tumor. Oh, swipe left if that bothers you. Guess I should update this. Now living life with a smaller tumor after brain surgery and turns out I have brain cancer. Oh, fuck. I'd like something serious, but let's be real. Who wants to date a girl with low stamina, trouble walking, or standing for long periods of time? Hoping to beat my battle with cancer, but I'm not getting any younger to wait around for love. Shrug. Still swipe left if that bothers bothers you. Aw. Oh, I really hope that someone, like, makes her day and starts dating her and, like, that just, she's in a shit situation. But it's nice to see someone who can just, like, that's inspiring how she can just make light of it and make a few jokes out of it. That, I don't know if I'd be able to do that. That is very inspiring. To be in that shit of a situation and still be such a happy-go-lucky person. That's a good at Tinder, just so you know. That's a good one. Paul, 29. It looks like his grandma just attacked him with a curler. You know what? I don't even know why this one's in here. I like Paul. I instantly liked Paul just from his picture. He looks like a good guy. Paul, 29. This is how, This is another good at Tinder. I don't... Why is this in here? Who, who put this... Yeah. I'm not gonna do that joke again. You guys know that I put my own pictures in my videos. I don't know. I thought it was gonna be funny. Look, he's got a curler in his hair. It's like, whoa, whoa, my grandma just attacked me. Oh, I make some grandma jokes about like how you just headbutted your grandma and got one of her curlers caught in your hair, but no, it's not that good. All right, I like you, Paul. You're doing a good job. Josie. 20. If you don't live at least an hour away, I don't want it on our first date. I'll bring the U-Haul, you can bring the cats, and we will ride off into the sunset. Hmm, I feel like some punctuation would have done this paragraph some justice. If you don't live at least an hour away, I don't want it on our first date. I'll bring the U-Haul, you bring the cats, and we will... So you're basically like, hey, we're gonna... I, I don't know what the hell you're trying to say. It looks like you want to move in with whoever matches with you right away. So you're looking for a cat man, a man who has a lot of cats who's just basically desperate to move in with someone. Okay, I get it, I get it. All right, Josie, I hope you find your love. Hi, hey Lacey, how's it going? Shit, pretend I spelt it right. So my name is spelled Lacey, FYI. So I guess we're not gonna pretend I spelt it right. Your bio is incredible, ha 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 ha. I cannot stop laughing. Well then, this seems like the perfect opportunity to send some unsolicited duck pics. Picture. Quack, quack. Quack, quack, quack. <laughs> oh my god, 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 oh my god. He totally just got laid because of this joke. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Rachel, 20. Made you look. Let's hang together. I like drinking coffee and complaining about hipsters. Also, am a hipster. Just sort of trying new things. Not really 20. Hmm, so how old are you? 16. Dot, dot, dot. And then he decided to report. Report. Get this kid the fuck off this app. It's true. Taylor, 23. Just looking for someone to appreciate the booty and watch Rick and Morty with myself and my dog. She's not really asking for a lot, actually. Ugh, I'm sure Taylor's gonna find someone. Oh, Taylor, I know a guy named Paul and you're both redheads, so you can talk about that. And also, if you ever have children, you'll make the cutest little redheaded children. I made a mess, squamp. 18. Is that a real name? Scomp? My name is Raven. I'll do an hour of whatever you want for 50 bucks. Okay, if I, this is a this is a trap. That person's gonna shoot you. Oh, and here's probably my favorite profile I've seen in a while. And uh, it's just a series of pictures. Someone put it into like a little GIF video thing, so I'll just show that. It's uh, this guy throwing a football to himself and then fumbling the same football thrown at himself. I like it. I don't know why but I just think it's inventive. Shows he has a sense of humor. You know, there's too many good ones in this. This video is a sham, I'm sorry. It's supposed to be your bad at Tinder. There's like three or four good ones, I'm sorry. I'm running out of Tinder profiles. I don't know what to do anymore. Anyway, that's the video, I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you in the next one, bye.